Well, the chief of the Muskogee Nation lays out his vision for his final term in office, and that means making sure no one takes away the tribe's right to create its own destiny ever again. Two News Oklahoma's Alexandra Blake was at today's inauguration and shows us what tribal leaders are working on for the next four years. As Muskogee Nation Principal Chief David Hill enters his second term, he celebrates the triumphs from the first, strengthening tribal law enforcement, tackling a pandemic, and expanding health care with cutting-edge technology. He purchased the Council Oak Comprehensive Health Care Center in Tulsa, become one of the only tribes in the country to offer robotic surgeries. Our newest hospital in, in Tulsa even houses the most extensive collection of Muskogee art worldwide. The artistic accomplishments don't stop there. Sterling Harjo, the creative force behind Reservation Dogs, shared his appreciation for the nation's support. They were there for us and, um, and you know, helped us every step of the way. It's the most successful TV show that's ever happened in this state. From creating art to shaping futures, the nation says it's also making moves in tribal sovereignty. In this next term, Principal Chief Hill says he's committed to strengthening his nation's grip on its land and rights. Other plans include harnessing alternative energy and making sure tribal members have the same opportunities as everyone else. Improving internet access will promote everything from economic growth to education and quicker access to government services. Standing firmly beside him is Second Chief Del Beaver. He says the last four years were challenging but fruitful, and he looks forward to the next four. We had weaknesses. We had some infrastructure issues that we didn't know, but it also showed our strengths. And without a doubt, our strengths were our people. People like Jessica Burgess, who came to celebrate the nation's traditions and find out what's in store for her future. Just a new, new time period of presidency and chiefdom, and I'm, I'm very proud to be here, and I'm very proud to be part of this tribe. In Tulsa, Alexandra Blake, 2 News, Oklahoma.